This feels like the inside of a tower. I'm Sean the Shepherd, and this is Adventures in Minecraft. Well, hello, and welcome back to another episode of Adventures in Minecrafting. While you've been away, I've been busy working on... Can you tell? Can you tell? Yeah, yeah, can you tell? Working on the mazes. And it, 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 to be honest, I, I... That's close. That's that's. I'm just being honest. That's close. Uh, I think we nailed it. Check this out. Okay, let me see. Let me see if I can get out of here. I'm getting my, lost in my own mazes. Okay, so I'm guessing, yeah, this way. Uh, this way, this way, this way, this way, this way, this way. Okay, now, now, hold on, just ignore this. Ig ignore this beautiful arbor. This beautiful arbor here with, uh, with a fancy new use for beetroots. I want to show you what the mazes look like from up in the sky. Check it out. You can tell we've done a little bit of work here. And now the mazes are pretty much complete. We put this lovely little fountain in the middle of both of them. And if we go down here, there are now two entrances. There's an entrance down at the far end, and there's an entrance from this central arbor. And so you can come in here and go through the maze, but I'm not going to do that because I'm going to get lost. Okay, let's come back here and let me show you what else I've been working on. I've been playing around with some, as you can tell, I've been sleeping outdoors. Sleeping outdoors is fun. I've been playing around here with some gate ideas because I wanted a gate here at the entrance to this uh, little arbor overhang area uh, that we've built here. Isn't this lovely? I decided instead of using... Uh, fences, I would use sideways chains, um, supporting up there all of these vines that have this lovely uh, red glazed terracotta fruit growing on them. You know, you know what would be perfect here? When we get those new flowers in 1.17, oh, those are going to be so cool. Those are going to add all the particle effects. But for right now, we're going to, we're going to, we're going to go with the red glazed terracotta. And then I thought I would play, I was gonna put berry bushes here, but then I thought, you know, we never use beetroot for anything and it's such a lovely bright red color, it would tie in with the red glazed terracotta. And so, here you go. Got a little exit from the compound and we've got a little entrance into complete with the two mazes. Now. Let me show you something here. Um, uh, how do I get through here? In the... Se nope, it's not that way. Uh, just, nope, not that way. Uh, okay, okay, we're getting close. We're getting close. Okay, I want to show you over here. We've got this these cute little fountains, and I put, put some grass in the bottom, and we could obviously put a fish in there, but I, I did one other thing. I did one other little special secret thing. You want to know my... You want to know it? You want to know it? You want to know my special secret thing? Watch this. Oh, it's not letting me swim. Let me swim. There we go. And we're out. Ha <laughs> ha. So I put in both of the ponds, I have put this little secret passageway. So if we're stuck in the maze or if we want to get to the center of the maze, we could come down and build something special underneath. Now, I have no idea what that something special would be, so I need your suggestions in the comments. Please, 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 what are we going to build underneath the garden that's a secret you can only get into through the ponds? Well, for right now, it just comes back out to this unfinished area. I'm leaving the dirt out here unfinished until we decide how we're going to design this. Today, what I want to do is continue to work on the garden proper. But of course, in order to continue to work... Oh, I almost nailed it. Darn, let's do that again. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Back here. And... One, two, three. There we go. Okay, before we work on the garden, however, before we start bringing in custom trees and putting in the flowers and all these flower beds along here, I think we need to do something about this. I think we need to tie our mansion 
into our backyard. Yes, we can go up on the balcony and look out over the garden, but we need a way to get directly in there other than hopping on some leaves. So, first thing we need to do is we need to move this portal. This portal's been here for a while, and I think I know exactly where I'm gonna put it. And there we go. Oh, I like it. Right across here from our balcony, right upstairs in our storage room where we spend all of our time. And by the way, look at this. <laughs> He's still gonna shoot me. Uh, this is quite the mob farm out here. Now that would make the maze fun. That would make the maze a lot of fun. So let's see if our new portal matches up to our old portal. There we go. Brings us right up here. They link up, which is perfect. Now let's head back through, see if it works going the other way. And there we go. Now I'm not sure what I'm going to put behind there yet, but uh, I really like this. Now some of you are going to ask though, weren't there stairs here before? And the answer is yes. Yes, there were. I really should sleep because because those those mobs are getting loud. Uh, there were stairs here before, but I never liked them. I never liked them. And that's the next plan. Do I have a bed? No, my bed is down there in the midst of the mobs. Should we should we have fun? Should we have some fun and go see if we can sleep? Oh, I know where there's a bed. There's a bed over here. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. There's a bed. Right. That's not a bed. Uh, there's a bed here. No, there's not a bed there. There's a bed in the kitchen. Nope, not a bed in the kitchen. There's a bed back here. Nope, nope, nope. I could have sworn. <sighs> I could have sworn I put a bed somewhere. Okay. Um, isn't this funny? <laughs> I, don't have, I don't have a bed. My bed's out in the middle of the mobs. Okay, let's go. Let's go for it. We're gonna go for it. We're gonna see if we can sleep. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, gotta kill this guy. Kill this guy. Boom. 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 And sleep. Sleep, sleep, sleep. Sleep, sleep. You can't turn your head while you're sleeping. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, we made it. Yes. Burn. Burn all you crazy mobs. Okay, we're going back. Now, we can begin working on a door in here um i don't have any blocks or somebody behind me isn't there uh yep there is thank you thank you for playing okay now we can begin to work on a doorway through here but first i need to take out all these old stairs Can I just say how exciting it is to have those stairs gone? Now, I know this is an ugly room. I know we haven't worked on this huge hall yet. I know it's just the outside of all the other beautiful little insides we've been doing. But now that these stairs are gone, oh, I can work with this. I can work with this. Now, the question that you're all asking is, well, what, what are we going to, how are we going to get upstairs? How are, we, how are we getting up? I mean, this, this is just a temporary structure back here. I just put this in as a uh, way for you to see my face really close. But we are going to put the stairs here because right outside of here, there is plenty of room. Uh, any mobs? Nope, no mobs. They all burned. Uh, did the, uh, even the Enderman's gone. Okay. Right outside of these stairs is a perfect place to add on, uh, add on to the mansion. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna put two towers, you know, Lord of the Rings, two, two towers. Okay, m maybe not Lord of the Rings towers. We're gonna put two towers here attached to the mansion and we're gonna put the stairs inside of them going up and down uh, with plenty of access from either side of the building. And I think we're gonna like those stairs a lot more. So let me get to work on figuring out a tower. Wait, before we do our tower, we need to move our planning wall. In fact, I, don't, I haven't looked on this in a while. Work on the mansion. Yeah, we do that every episode. Uh, Wither Skulls kill the weather. Hey, we did that. Smelter, we built a smelter. 
Gardens, gardens, we're working on that right now. Wow, we've gotten a lot done. Wheat field, we have not done yet. Netherite tools and weapons, we have not done yet. Uh, though we have some nice, snazzy netherite armor. Uh, let's see. Upgrade mob farm to be more efficient. Haven't done that yet. B, apiary. Okay, so all of these we need to move somewhere. I had an idea for this. Where was my idea? Hmm. Hmm. Do you remember where my idea was? Well, I, I couldn't find a wall I really wanted to use right now. So we're going to have a planning book. That's right. There we go. There's our, all our little ideas for planning that we haven't done yet and more that we're going to add later. We'll just keep it right here with our workbench. Right here by our netherite. Hmm. Right by our portal. I have an idea for what to put behind the portal. And just like that, our nether portal now has some lovely lava behind it. Now, I put in some uh, red stained glass in between the portal and the lava so that you can't, you know, go into the portal and, uh, well, get your face burned off. But that'll do for now. Now that we've got our planning wall moved to a planning book, we can head down and start working on these towers. Can you tell I'm procrastinating? Oh, hi. Hi. Hey there. <laughs> You know, I, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, Sean, Sean, you're you're procrastinating. You're you're still procrastinating. Hey, can I get up here? Yeah, I can get up here. Cool. Hey, yeah, but you know what? I'm 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 not actually not actually procrastinating. I just was thinking we're building a garden and I'm a little limited on flowers. In fact, I have very few few yeah very few of the tulips we're gonna need a lot more flowers than this to build a garden so it's probably a good idea that i just built the towers yep that's right come on let's go take a look we head on back here behind our lovely mansion wait for it wait for it wait for it and there they are, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get another little look up here. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm loving it. There's the mazes we made today. And look at these lovely towers. We've even put in some spruce trees, some real looking spruce trees or cypress trees. Uh, there, I guess those look like cypress trees. We built these two lovely, lovely towers. I'll show you the inside of them in just a minute. Uh, you'll notice up here, we moved those beams that were holding the balcony up and we curved them right into the building. I like that. I like that a lot. We've even added right here, started to add windows that look very similar to the windows that we have on the front. In fact, if you look at the towers, Okay, just look at the materials that we... Well, don't fall off there. But if you look at the materials we've used here, and then if I take you around the front, what you'll see is I've designed the whole thing to look very similar, to look like it belongs. Let's see, can we land on a tree here? There we go. Ow. Okay, see the, see the use of just a, a trim of diorite. There's some hint of granite in there. We've got... The, um, we have the stripped oak beams holding the whole thing up along with some uh, along with some stone brick. Now if you come around here you'll see we've built we built the towers with many of the same things and then I sort of messed them up just a little bit and that's what we've got. I've even gone ahead and started adding some, us uh, adding some plants in here, some planters in here. Started building out our deck here. And this um, uh, this is stone and polished andesite. And these are the materials we used on the front steps. So you see everything is tying itself together. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Can I open the door backwards? Nope. Can't open the door backwards. Okay, let's head on in here. And here's the inside of the windows. Not that you needed to see that, but they're tied into the front windows. And if we go over here, we can go to either side. There's one over there. And there's one over here. 
Uh, we can head right on up to the next floor, spin around once here, and there we go. We're on to our main floor. This is where the steps used to be going down. And if we want to head up further still, look at this. Spin around once, and we're... Oh, uh, twice. Because this is... This one takes us all the way up to the top floor, and we come out here, so we can come down, and we can also go down here to the next floor, and come out on our balcony, have a look at our towers. There's one tower, there's two towers. It's like Lord of the Rings all over the place. And if we want to head over here, we can run right up these steps and into our little stairwells that are lighted by our lovely shroom lights all the way down got some little windows look out on the garden come on down the stairs here and we're back to the main floor let's take it in folks let's take it in one more trip into the sky oh yeah Well, hey, thanks for watching today here on Adventures in Minecraft. If you haven't yet hit that subscribe button or the like button or I don't know, any of those buttons, please feel free to do so, you know, if you want to. And I'll see you in the next episode of Adventures in Minecrafting. Bye-bye.